ever told you that you were the boss? What makes you the boss? Do you know how to be a boss? I know what a boss is. I've always been a boss, am a boss, and always will be a boss. Hi ladies, welcome back to the Classy Lady Squad. My name is Andrea Kinlotch and I am your host. The Classy Lady Squad is a community where women are impacting women through evaluated experiences, cultivating and leveling up. My topic for today is who's really the boss? If you know what I am about to say, you are an extraordinary person and you belong to the top small percentage and you are to be applauded. If you don't know what I'm about to talk about, you are holding yourself back and you're missing out on something great in life. I would like to talk about who's really the boss and your relationship with them. How you handle the boss will determine your success and or failure. It will determine how much money you make, don't make, if you're happy, unhappy. Every person has the same boss. And the boss is simply the customer. He is the one boss you must please because he pays for everything you own. He pays for your homes, your cars, your doctor bills, your vacation, and he is the one that signs your checks. He will discharge you if you mistreat him or displease him. We often lose sight on what a business really is. We offer our ideas, our products, and our services, and our intentions are to please the customer's needs, wants, and desires. The customer is the one that's in charge. We must become more skilled and most talented and know our customer and our product. We must do more, we must go overboard to please the customer. The customer, again, is the boss. Buyers and providing excellent customer service. The money will show up when you are producing what the customer needs, wants, and desire. Once you learn who your customer is, what he needs, what he wants, and what he desires, everything else will fall in place. You just have to provide excellent, extraordinary customer service discretion on where he spends his money. There are so many choices for the customer to choose. What are you going to do different that the customer is, you know, has no choice but not leave you? How are you treating your customers? Are you listening to them? It is at the customer's discretion where he spends his money. He certainly has choices. If you treat the customer badly, they feel that you haven't earned it, it meaning their business. How is your attitude towards what you do for a living? Are you too busy trying to be the boss? And also be very careful on how you and your associates have the mental attitude that the customer needs you. Without that customer, there will not be jobs, there will not be a business, and there will not be a lifestyle for you. The customer, again, is the one and only boss that dictates your lifestyle. Earning your place in the economy should never be confused with keeping it. 
You must earn your place day after day, year after year. There is not a company that could not go out of business. It all depends on how the boss is treated. The boss meaning the customer. If you have earned the respect of the customer, he will bring others. Your rewards is an exact proportion of your services. We get paid exactly what we've earned, but no more that we get paid. Tangible, meaning money, and intangible, meaning inner satisfaction. You will be able to spend and feel your results. Again, our rewards will be an exact proportion of our services. Ladies, this is part one of who's really the boss. I will have part two this week of who's really the boss. I appreciate you tuning in today. If you have not subscribed to the channel yet, please go down below and hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. That way you will be notified every time I upload a video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it so much, give it a thumbs down. Go in the comments, ladies, and let's talk about it. Ladies, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope that it motivates you, empowers you, and adds value to you. And always, always know who you are, stay in your truth, and own it. So until the next time, until the next video, peace for now.